Hi, I'm Dr. Ricardo Rodriguez, and today I want to talk to you about a tummy tuck, right? So the whole trick with a tummy tuck is to get this piece of skin here over the belly button to reach down here. Now, in order to do that, right, you just can't pull on it. You got to separate it from the tissues. And the problem is that when you separate it to the from the tissues underneath, you're also eliminating some of its blood supply. So the trick is to get it down there with a maximum amount of blood supply. So let's say we cut out the skin here, right? Cause we wanna, that's a excess skin. You might have stretch mark, whatever there, you wanna get rid of it, extra skin. So underneath all of that, you have the muscles. Those are the rectus muscles that you wanna fix when you're gonna do the tummy tuck. But those muscles also have blood supply that goes up to the skin. So I'm just gonna show, this is just showing like a transparency overlay or something. And then you also have from the external obliques, you also have nerves and blood vessels coming into, then some blood vessels from the chest and some blood vessels here from the groin that are coming up. So those are your sources of blood supply. Now, depending on how much tissue you separate, you eliminate more or less blood supply. So we cut out the skin in here, right? And we see the muscle. And now let's get this from here to down here. Well, to do that now, we got to deal with the blood supply, right? So what are we going to do with all this blood supply? Well, with a traditional um, tummy tuck technique, what you do is you undermine all of this so that you can take this skin here and bring it down like a curtain, right? And close it with a single line down in here. So now your only sources of blood supply are from the sides, coming in from the side or coming in from the chest. That means you can't get very aggressive liposuctioning down here on the sides because if you liposuctioning too aggressively there, your only blood supply is this, and that's really not that great. Now, you go in and you sew the muscle, and then you bring the skin down and you close it, right? But there's a problem with that. And the problem is that you have now all this empty space. And in all this empty space that's been detached, you can get blood collections, and that's what's called seromas or hematomas. Now, my favorite technique is called a Lockwood technique. And what you do with a Lockwood, Lockwood technique is that instead of undermining all of that, you just undermine in between here in the space where you want to sew the muscle and you leave all of this attached. And you know, if you stand up and you grab your belly here on the side, you know you can make it pinch and make it reach. Now, if you try to do it in the center, you can't. So that's why we mobilize and we mobilize only from here on down. That means that all this space get, stays attached. And because it stays attached, all that blood supply and even the nerves stay intact. Okay, now, compare the amount of dissection with a regular tummy tuck where all of this is empty and you eliminate all that supply with a Lockwood technique where you have more blood supply, more nerves. So after surgery, your skin has a lot better sensation. Now you fix the muscle in both, but the other one is um, a lot better. Now I'm gonna play you um, a little video in here of how the, um, the whole dissection goes. And if you can see here is the belly, right? And then uh, here's the skin and I have a retractor there. And um, see, those are the edges of the muscle that we're gonna sew up. We're gonna sew that to that, right? And then what I'm pointing at uh, in there is if you see these little things going on the side and I'm pointing out there right there, I'm pointing out vessels and nerves, okay? That are gonna supply this tissue here and the tissue up there. So all of that tissue, we don't separate. So the blood supply there is going into instantaneously, okay? And then when we uh, bring the skin down, as you can see here, all that skin, we're gonna be getting rid of all that skin, okay? So then the only space that's gonna be left, you know, empty is here and that narrow tunnel. So here's the thing, we correct the muscle, we close it, and then we close it with a single line. So the scar for the look would looks pretty much the same as the other techniques. Uh, the nice thing about it is that because you have better blood supply and less empty space, you get less complications. And as a bonus, the scar tends to stick down here 
a lot better because of the way we close it. And we can talk about that in another time. But anyways, I love the Lockwood, Lockwood technique and it's my favorite. See you later.